This tutorial shows how to configure exam types for multiple units in QPath. For example, you see too many extra exam types under Facility A exams, and you would like to remove some of the procedural exam types. For the exam type configuration, you require this set of security roles for your security group. Click on Security tab and select Units. By default, the exam types are set up at the top root unit. Select the top unit and click Exam Types. All exam types are set to on here, which means that all locations below inherit these exam types. First, we need to turn off our exam type at the top level. As you see the system doesn't allow turning of the exam type, because the attached worksheets are enabled here. Double-click on the exam type to open the worksheets and turn them off. Now, turn off the exam type. As you see procedural abscess exam type is now disabled for all units. Let's bring it back to facility B unit. So we select the needed unit and turn on our exam type. The worksheets should be also enabled. Let's do one more procedural exam to repeat the configuration steps. Go to the top unit, double-click on the exam type to open the worksheets. Turn off the worksheets and now turn off the exam type. Click on Facility B unit and turn on our exam type there. Don't forget to turn on the worksheets as well. Repeat the same with the rest of the exam types. Now we can check the setup on the exams. Let's go back to our exams list. Select a Facility A exam and click Edit. The exam type drop-down field doesn't contain procedural exams as expected. Now, let's open the edit form for the Facility B exam and check the exam type options. Procedural exams are available, which is what we need for this setup. Let's check one exam under Facility B ICU subunit. This exam also contains the options for the procedural exams as expected. Hope you find this tutorial helpful.